Thank you so much to the EA Creator Network for sponsoring this video. The Sims 4 Lovestruck expansion pack is honestly the perfect expansion pack for me because there are two things that I love that this pack embodies. One of them being woohoo and romance and the second one being chaos. And you could definitely turn your Sims' romantic love life chaotic with this new pack. Thanks to the AA Creator Network, I was given early access to the Sims 4 Lovestruck expansion pack. And today we are going to go ahead and explore the new world of Ciudad and Amarada and dive right into these new romantic and steamy interactions with a new sim of mine. This is Celeste Singh. Celeste, I made her a while ago. I posted a little preview of her over on Twitter last month. My Twitter is Solita Sims. And now today we get to meet her and hang out with her and go and see what this new pack has to offer. But here's the thing. We're not just gonna play around with this pack. We're not just gonna go willy nilly and do whatever. No, I have a plan. I have a goal. And that goal is I want Celeste to woohoo with every single new male townie that comes with this pack. Oh yes, oh yes. We are going to do some home wrecking. We are going to do some public woohoo. We are going to get a little messy right now because, um, hello, have you met me? I already know I'm gonna have so much fun with this. Anyways, let me introduce you guys to Celeste, the star of this video. Celeste is a young adult living in Ciudad and Amarada. She is currently living in a penthouse lot in the neighborhood of Nuevo Corazon. Her pronouns are she, her, and she is a straight Indian woman. At this moment, in time the five traits the more traits and cast mod by the pancake one is broken and my heart is as well because that mod is everything to me but that's fine that's fine she has three traits at the moment which are dance machine heartbreaker heartbreaker is a trait from sims 4 modern maple bell and one of the new traits that comes with this pack called love bug and she does have one of the new aspirations that comes with this pack which is romantic explorer this sim wants to explore all that romance has to offer and girl we will definitely be doing that today so yes like I said the whole goal of today's video is that we want Celeste to get down and dirty with every single male sim that has come with this pack which would include Carlos Lopez, Yoltik Shikotenkato, Aziz Nadir, and my personal favorite from the <laughs> gameplay trailer Manuel Aguilar. I also want to mention that I'm happy to announce I've become an EA affiliate meaning that whenever you use my code Solita Sims at checkout on the EA app or on the Sims 4 official website when buying any Sims 4 DLC I will get a small commission from that sale. So if you would like to support me and this channel, this would be a great way to do so. Again, that is Solita Sims at checkout on the EA app or on the Sims 4 website when purchasing any Sims 4 DLC. Thank you so much for all your support always. And here she is, the beautiful Celeste Singh. She looks so great. I love this little outfit that I put on her. This is a custom content outfit that she has on at the moment. However, most of her outfits, majority of them are outfits from this new pack. And I have to say something about this new pack. I am genuinely a very big, EA clothing hater like big time big time but one thing I really do adore about this pack is the cast items I think they're amazing pretty much all of them there's some things that are very trendy there's some things that are very basic there are some things that are um a bit questionable of course I had to put her in this peach <laughs> Of course, I have to try it. I have to try it. Whenever she does begin to woohoo, I have to see that on her in action. So, and she's killing it. So I don't want to hear nothing in the comments. So the layout of this penthouse actually does come with the pack, but I did redecorate it heavily with a few CC objects, but mostly objects from this new pack. And another thing, yes, I do think the build mode is spectacular as well. It is gorgeous. I am obsessed with these chairs and these tables. The flowers are really pretty. These candles are really nice. And of course, the vibrating heart bed is bad. Back. Love that. Finally, after all these years. And of course, I had to add the new game that came with this pack. I was so curious about it when I saw the trailer. It turns out you can play thumbs up with or woo who with. <laughs> I'm gonna have fun with this. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm so excited. But for her room, basically, I wanted to make it kind of like a woohoo paradise. Like it's just the epitome of romance and steaminess and just, she's gonna have all of her, her misters in here. No, I'm just kidding. I do want one of them to be here on this vibrating bed. That's for sure. But I think for the other locations, I do want to try the new closet location that comes with this pack and the blanket. And yes, she will be just woohooing with these Sims. Okay. She will not be getting wicked. Okay. Because wicked whims is broken. <laughs> 
it's very broken and I want to explore these new pack features. So what I'm thinking, where are we going? I think I want to take Celeste to the gym first. Sudor, it's a singles hangout apparently and I didn't renovate this at all so I have no idea what to expect. But let's head on over to Sudor. All right, we've made it to Sudor. For the life of me, I'm hoping that one of those four guys pops up, but until then, let's just have her maybe, I don't know, do some strength training. Gotta make her look cute for the gym bros. Look at that walk, she knows damn well. She knows. Yes, girl, give us nothing, yes. <gasps> oh, 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 we found conquest number one. We found conquest number one. Carlos Lopez is here, okay. <laughs> this man is so fine, y'all so fine i was looking at all the townies from this new pack and i realized they're all very attractive it's like what is going on over there at ea what <laughs> they've been stepping it up lately she's walking up the stairs looking all cute in her little gym outfit looking all confident she's gonna use that feminine walk to her advantage okay okay let's say hi to carlos girl what the hell was that suggestive conversation sentiments about carlos her first impression is cool this sim strikes celeste as pretty cool they just have this popular insider vibe she's talking about yoga with him i think that's code for something else carlos are we picking up on that just yet oh my god she's bold already asking him risque questions and everything what the hell we're embracing already oh okay okay oh i forgot about this romantic satisfaction okay romantic satisfaction begins celeste and carlos have a strong romantic relationship and will now have independent nope don't go away independent romantic satisfaction levels high romantic satisfaction will make maintaining romantic relationships easier low romantic satisfaction will make maintaining romantic relationships more difficult okay carlos i choose you <laughs> whoa wait 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 celeste what i choose you it's clear to me now that you're the one i want to be with you guys just met two seconds ago you've been an irreplaceable presence in my life and i value our connection deeply i believe in us and i want to see where our relationship can go let's move this forward together girl y'all just met two minutes ago this is so sims 4 coded let's look over here at the romantic panel now and let's go ahead and see what he's all about so he's a high school graduate lovebirds good compatibility Celeste's romantic feelings about carlos is a neutral her satisfaction is fine and carlos's is unknown for both interesting and they both have the same cool sentiment about each other okay i'm liking where this is going already i forgot to mention celeste's is romantic or relationship preferences as well of course she likes men for both woohoo and romance she has no romantic exploration and she and everything triggers her jealousy honey physical woohoo and non-physical and she's exploring romantic boundaries Okay. Oh my goodness. They're. F oh my goodness. Yo, they just met. The God. Oh my goodness. Did you guys see how fast that went? <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Y'all, look at her neck. Oh my God. Okay, this does not come with this bag. This is a mod. This is the Hickey's mod. I haven't seen it yet. I just installed this mod. I was not expecting that. Oh, oh, oh. I know later when she gets back to her place, her vibrating bed is going to hate seeing them coming. Oh, <laughs> this just escalated so quick. I've never had a sim relationship escalate so fast. Is this a glitch? Is this supposed to happen? Because I'm scared to check the relationship bar now. What are her moodlets? Okay, decisive moments from final choice. Final. Celeste feels a mix of relief and uncertainty after making the decision to choose one love interest over the other. While she is glad to have clarity, she also wonders about the impact of her choice on both relationships. Girl, what? Hickey. <laughs> um wow okay and y'all are doing all this in the gym oh lord oh lordy lord girl her neck her neck, her neck is kind of i was really hoping he would ask her out on a date i'm trying to get him to autonomously ask her out on a date because i don't want to jump right to the woohoo just yet you know like take me out to dinner first okay so these are the new interactions from the relationship panel we can ask about his romantic style attraction physical attraction personality attraction learn more about everything okay let's let's ask about his romantic attraction style i want to know more about Carlos. So his turn-ons are physical intimacy and woohoo. Lucky for us, hers is gift giving and woohoo. So they're compatible when it comes to one of their turn-ons. But his turn-off is flirting? 
Were you not just flirting? Did you guys <laughs> not just meet like a sim hour ago and I've already decided that you guys are the one for each other? You're flirting right now, but you don't like flirting. She's literally being flirted with. Let's look about physical attraction and personality attraction. Looks aren't everything, but I truthfully do look out for some physical aspects in a partner. Turn-ons are outdoorsy, polished, preppy, fashion, and red clothes. Turns off are hipster rocker and pink clothes. While there are a few things I care about when it comes to a partner's personality, these are the things I care about. His turn-ons are wealthy sims, drink-making sims, health and sporty sims, ambitionless sims, okay? red flag and high energy sims his turn offs are highly skilled sims also red flag arts and craft skills performance skills sense of humor sense of humor carlos oh, you're giving me the ick right now dude okay and family motivated sims oh my god this guy's a bum huh this guy's the worst huh he is isn't he where are you going you're not gonna ask me out on a date for now we're gonna leave carlos alone okay i think i want to play hard to get right now i think that'd be interesting <laughs> and then eventually if he doesn't contact her then we'll just have to contact him but let's go ahead and go somewhere new i was thinking maybe the lounge this is laguna del abrazo and this is in the vista hermosa neighborhood okay so I changed my mind. <laughs> We're not going to the lounge. We're actually at Media Naranja, which is a park in the other neighborhood of town. It is such a gorgeous build, y'all. I saw this in the live stream and I immediately fell in love with this build. Might I even say, maybe this is a little controversial, but I think this is the best EA build ever. And I know EA didn't build it. And I know they had a certain builder in particular make this build, but it is gorgeous. It is beautiful. Everything about it, the color scheme, the furniture, the greenery. I just, I'm in love with it. Firstly, I'm gonna change Miss Girl's outfit since she's no longer at the gym. These are some lovely outfits from the pack and I was thinking this pink dress would be super cute on her and it is. By the way, y'all, can we talk about this necklace? Sims team, oh my. <laughs> since we're here, oh, the bartender left. Uh, hello? Hello, Miss uh, uh, May Prescott, where are you going? Aw, the land grabs. <laughs> <laughs> They're flirting. They're watching the sky. That's so cute. I do think this interaction is so adorable. Maybe in the meantime, we should just start some drama <laughs> and try to steal Nancy's husband. Why not? Why not? Let's see how this goes. <gasps> oh! Oh! Oh, she's pissed. She's pissed. Oh no, romantic dissatisfaction. Hold up, I need to control her to see what's going on. There's something about ruining Nancy's life that just does it for me. This isn't the first save file where I've ruined her life before. Angry, flirty spouse from jealousy. Nancy's spouse was flirting with another. Have they been doing this behind her back? Looming anxiety from fear of being cheated on. Oh, she has a fear of being cheated on. Welp, and extreme dissatisfaction. From being very unsatisfied in a romantic relationship, Nancy can't get her mind off of her failing relationship. While very unsatisfied, the romantic relationship with her partner will fade away more quickly. Oh no. She gained two sentiments too, betrayed from cheating and furious about cheating. Oh, oh, oh my God. And he's still going. He's still going with his wife looking right at them. He does not care at all. She's over here all pissed. She's giving them the death stare. He does not care. Look at her, y'all. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> Aw, I just found out about this cute little flower shop. That's adorable. Buy gifts, buy flowers, and buy bouquet flowers. That's so cute. I'm actually surprised that this works. I thought it would be like a decoration or something. <gasps> Oh, so this is Aziz Nadir. And the thing about him is that he is a married man, honey. Oh, we are about to do some home wrecking. Let's go see what's up with him. And look, he's a cutie. Like I said, the townies, they really ate with the townies. Mice himself would love to take a ride on the Aziz Express. How is that a flirty interaction? I don't understand. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, all the men in this city are dogs. Absolute dogs. He keeps flirting with her off the bat. Oh, here we go with the romantic satisfaction again. Let's maybe do one of the new interactions, like what Jeffrey and Nancy were doing before I ruined their marriage. <laughs> Watch Sky with Aziz. Oh, oh, this is so cute with the hickeys from Carlos on her neck still. This is going so well. 
I was not expecting it for it to be this easy for her to get two, no, three men under her belt now with Jeffrey Landgrab being one of them. This animation is so adorable. I think it's time now for girl to have her first woohoo. What are y'all thinking? I'm thinking it's time because the romance bar is extremely high. So we're gonna go ahead and ask to woohoo with the Z's. He said yes! Oh my goodness. And she acquired the romance skill. Celeste's new skill in romance will allow her to successfully flirt more frequently and romance other sims faster. Celeste can now research romance tips on the computer and perform a romantic introduction. Ooh. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, wow. Uh. <laughs> Break out the candles and make it romantic. Celeste is about to woo for the first time. I'm really curious what the ending animation is gonna be. Damn, that door is gonna break. Oh, it did. Oh, sneaky. Oh my goodness. You cheated on your wife, buddy. You should not be that happy. Well, we have one down and we have three to go. He did not just fall asleep. He did not just fall asleep. Girl, you put him to sleep. You put him to sleep, honey. Damn, and I was just thinking about whipping out the board game with him as well, but that's fine. That's fine because we still have three other men, three other townies we need to get with. So we were even in the gym and then we went to the park over here. Now it's time. I think we're going to go to the lounge and we're going to go to the nightclub when it's a little bit later. We're here at the lounge and it turns out Aziz followed her. Um, Don't know if I should be concerned, but um, prepare to get your heart broken because Yoltik is right here and he's actually the entertainer. Okay, interesting. But first, let's go and have her change her outfit. New man, new outfit. Since it's a lounge, we can get a little laid back and comfortable. This is all from the new pack. I'm loving, loving this tube top. And these jeans are super cute and these white sneakers, just everything about it is so nice. And here we are in the lounge and oh, he's a pianist. Oh, he's pretty good at it too. Look at her coming in all sexy and confident. She's keeping her eye on the prize, honey. He's actually really good at this. <laughs> well, if he's good at piano, then you know he's gonna be good at something else. Anyways, um, let's leave him a tip, I guess. Celeste has learned that Yoltik has the folly skill piano. No, really. No, I, I had no idea. She is getting a bit hungry. So while we wait for Yoltik to finish, maybe we can buy a snack real quick. Maybe some pita and tapas. Oh, he is done. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't have time to lose. We don't have time to lose. Here she goes, slapping him silly again, because apparently that's a romantic introduction. <gasps> Whoa, what? What was his sentiment? Hers about Yoltik was in dreamland. The sim appears to be a little bit in their own bubble of imagination, a dreamland of sorts. Whoa, what was yours? What was yours? Anti-crush? Sentiment of dislike? Is dislike at first sight a thing because Yoltik really doesn't like Celeste's overall vibe? <gasps> oh, so this is gonna be a struggle, I see. Yoltik immediately doesn't like her. What did she do to you? Okay, maybe not flirt with him immediately. She's showing him her sexy outfit, being like, you want a piece of this? Compliment hair, why not? I'm just going off. I'm just trying to get them to be in a place. <laughs> That's good, since he apparently doesn't like her and thinks her vibe or her aura is off. <gasps> oh no! Oh no! What happened? Celeste has learned the following traits about Yoltik. He's loyal. Does he have a woman? It doesn't say he has a partner. Oh, you're gonna be a struggle. You're gonna be a struggle, aren't you? Okay, that's fine. Because I like a challenge. I adore a challenge, honey. Smooth recovery. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is not going well. Oh no! Come on now. Let's sit. Let's chat. Like grown adults. Come on, you must be somewhat attracted. <gasps> he hates her. Is he taking notes about her? I'm scared. That's fine. We will go to the nightclub next and we will try again to find either Carlos again or Manuel and we'll make our way back to Yoltik eventually, which is going to take a lot of work from what I can see. So let's go ahead and go uptown back to Nuevo Corazon, her neighborhood, and go to Mirador del Amor, the nightclub, and it's a singles hangout. All right, we're here at the nightclub and I have her changed into this really cute outfit from the new pack. I am in love with this one. The hair is also from the new pack as well as these heart shaped earrings. And then I realized too, one thing I haven't explored yet is Cupid's Corner. I know it's not really necessary for this challenge that I'm doing of her finding all of these guys, but I was like looking at the profiles and y'all, look at who one of her matches is. <laughs> you know that Alexis, <laughs> my legacy founder sim, is looking up at her. Like, don't you dare. <laughs> I'm 
don't you dare go after my man. Okay, but we're here at the nightclub and um, I'm wondering, should she get a drink? I've just been cheating her needs away because we really don't have time for that. But I think maybe, maybe she should get a little drinky drink. And Vlad's doing the drinks. Let me steal the mold wine. Let me steal it. Let me steal it. Let me steal it. Or is it gone? <gasps> it's gone. What if I stole her beer? Yeah, a free drink. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Carlos is here. Oh my goodness, this couldn't have worked out any better. I think what I wanna do is I wanna play that board game with him. Or should we just go home? Should we just go back to, to her place? Should we just ask him to go back with us to our place? He is not liking the romance music. <laughs> yeah, take these kisses. That should calm me down a little bit. I want him to autonomous. <gasps> oh, you are garbage. <gasps> His trait is mean? Oh my goodness, what the heck? She's crying. Why would you do that? Don't tell me she's apologizing. Girl, why would you apologize? You did nothing wrong. Let's just get this over with so I never have to see this man again. Okay, we're here at Celeste's place. He has gotten very comfortable very fast. Is he gonna turn on her TV? Oh my God, I hate this man. I hate this man. Damn, and I thought he was cute. That is so annoying. Okay, let's have them both go sit outside. And I don't know if I wanna use the bed or if I wanna use the picnic blanket for when it's time to get down and dirty. But for now, we're just gonna play, let's play woohoo. I don't wanna know what this is about so bad. Oh. She likes it on a desk apparently. Okay. Where does he like it? Where does he like it? He's not telling her what 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 oh oh I see eat oh pizza okay it's innocent I thought <laughs> I thought I was talking about something else where is his favorite woohoo -woo spot yet again and he's still not telling her okay I think I like this game would it be controversial if I asked the Sims team if they can actually make this game real because I would 110% buy it she is such a cutie okay they're about to wrap up so I think after that we're gonna go ahead to the I think do picnic blanket i think i want to keep the bed for manuel they can snuggle first yeah they could snuggle first carlos is feeling a romantic connection for celeste and wants to suggest a date do you want this to happen no let's just stick with getting to the woohoo this is a new interaction from this pack oh that's cute does he deserve it no he deserves nothing he is so fine though i hate that <laughs> It's always the trash ones that are the finest ones. But this animation is so cute. I can't deny it. That is adorable. Oh, she kissed his forehead. It's so cute. Okay, now I want to get them to woohoo on the blanket, but I don't think they can until they've had their first kiss. So we're going to go ahead and kiss this man. What the hell? <gasps> they can have their first kiss on the blanket? I didn't know that. That's adorable. Wait. Okay, now we can. Okay, it's go time. Oh my god, I didn't know they could have a first kiss on the blanket. <gasps> oh! Oh! <laughs> it's going all over the place. Oh! The noises. Uh, 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 oh my. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> you, can't <laughs> you can't see my face right now, but girl, my my jaw was on the floor. Did you hear? Carlos? Oh my goodness. Oh, now she stinks. <laughs> I am loving this pet. <laughs> We have two done, two done, okay? We've done Carlos and we've done Aziz. We just have Manuel and Yoltik left. Look at him, he's like, whoa, why are you recording this? <laughs> Well, that was um, interesting to say the least, but I enjoyed that. I think these two new woohoo animations are actually super cute, guys. I really enjoyed it, even if it was with this trash man. I think it's time to kick him out now, so bye 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 Thank you for uh, that wonderful time, Mr. Happy to never see you ever again. It is the morning. It is six o'clock and I think it's time. Oh, she's feeling real good. Um, I think it's time for Celeste to go back out into the world and just start wreaking havoc again on these male Sims' lives. And I think our first visit is going to be 
to the Nadir household. Yep, yep. We're going to go ahead and visit Aziz. <laughs> And I think, yeah, I think I want to break a marriage up. Oh, and if you're enjoying this video so far, maybe think about leaving a like, comment, and subscribe for me. It really helps me out. Thank you so much. Turns out he lives in the penthouse right across from her. So let's go ahead and get checked in. And she has one of her cute little outfits on, but I'm going to go ahead and change that yet again. I want you guys to see all of the outfits that she has on that comes with this pack, or at least most of them. Let's do something a little scandalous and a little obvious. The peach dress. <laughs> so Aziz knows exactly what she's here for. Oh, they got a nice place. This is a nice little loft. Okay, so there he is. Where is his wife? She's in here. <laughs> Okay, okay. Let's just get straight, straight to it. Woohoo with the Z's. He'd have to be bold to say yes when your wife's in the next room. <gasps> oh. <laughs> oh, Valentina, I am so sorry, but not really though. Um, I'm hoping she comes upstairs and she catches him in the act. This bed is amazing too. He has heart pant <laughs> panties. He has heart draws on. There they go. There they go. Valentina, do you have any idea? <gasps> oh no. Oh no. <gasps> oh, oh no. Oh no, no, no. I'm saying no, like I didn't want this to happen. <gasps> She's not noticing. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, what? I wonder now. Do they have an open dynamic? Is that why he, she's not reacting? Oh, she's reacting though. <laughs> oh no, no, she's jealous. What? Oh no. Girl, that's his wife. You're the homewrecker here, not them. This has me wondering now. Hold up, hold up. I'm actually going to control her real quick. I want to know, are they open? It doesn't trigger her. Non-physical does though, but physical doesn't. So they're, they're fine with that. No wonder why he was flirting. Well, let's still do non-physical just to, just to upset her. Oh, is she leaving? Oh, she's leaving for work. No. <laughs> Well, my plan failed. <laughs> my plan to ruin Valentina's marriage failed because they're in an open relationship pretty much. So I guess that was a flop, but that was fun, I guess. She's so mad. Oh no, now her romantic satisfaction has gone down. Okay, well, we need to get her mind off that now. Looking for Manuel or Yoltik right now. Please, please come out of hiding. We could go straight to his house, honestly. That might be a little desperate, but you know what? Yoltik is also there. Oh, look who's standing outside. Each and every one of them. Oh, and now she's so sad because of what happened. You got some nerve to be the one crying. Let's change her outfit yet again. Let's change it to this one. This one's cute. We need a cute outfit for this one right here. Hello, hello. I've been waiting to meet you in the flesh. How are you? He's so fine. Whoever made him <laughs> needs a raise. I can't give a romantic introduction because she's sad. That's just... That's just great. Um. Okay, so I guess we'll just do a friendly introduction for right now. Oh, he has a heart. He's enamored? Wait a minute, he's enamored with her already. She finds him in dreamland, which is a sentiment of dislike. Girl, you can't be picky. You can't be picky after Carlos and Aziz, but he has a crush on her already. That was quick, okay. Not all hope is lost, girl, okay? He finds you attractive. He's already crushing on you. All right, they have a romance bar going. Introduction to attraction at a glance. Celeste has a neutral attraction to Manuel. Sims become attracted or unattracted to others based on their turn-ons and turn-offs. Sims will recognize some turn-ons and turn-offs instantly, like those dealing with colors of fashion. Other turn-ons and turn-offs will require Sims to learn more about each other before causing attraction to change. Got it. He's really liking her. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm cheating it away. I'm cheating it away. I do not have time for this. We got things to do, honey. Like Manuel. Oh my god, all of these houses are so nice. Well, there is Yoltik again. He it does look like he's in a bad mood. Let's see if we can like help him a bit because he looks in distress. So let's see if we can comfort him. And that can lead to somewhere. Want to go bowling tonight? Here, this is special. No, bye. We're done with you forever. Come on, you guys gotta like each other. He's calling her now. Dude, I don't care. I don't care. Follow your heart. I do not care. Okay. They seem to be getting along a bit. Work with me, Yoltik. Work with me. He's making jokes. Okay, he's inspired now. He was tense. Where are you going? Ooh, they're both here. They're both here. Anyways, um, should I flirt with the both of them at the same time? <laughs> 
I'm thinking, I'm thinking I just might do that. Well, okay, I can't flirt with Yoltik because I don't want to mess up the progress they've made. So we'll just, we'll be friendly. We'll discuss interests, have deep conversations, stuff like that. And we'll be flirty with Manuel. Confess our attraction to him. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. This is going to take a minute, but their friendship is up. So we're just going to have to be super nice to him still and see what happens. He keeps looking at her. Look at him. And her romance with Manuel is going up and up and up. Okay. Let's try flirting with Yoltik now. Their friendship bar is a bit higher. So let's see what happens. No, he's rejecting her again. She's confused. <laughs> Girl, so am I. I it's happening. Carlos. Wait, he's here? Oh no. Oh, she's about to reject a marriage proposal. <gasps> oh no. Is he gonna propose to her? Well, she said hell no. You wanna see how much she doesn't care about you, Carlos? How much she doesn't wanna marry you? You can see for yourself, buddy. You can, you can go ahead and just... Straight out. Celeste and Carlos seem to have a hit rough patch with their romance. Romantic partners with this strange romantic dynamic will gravitate towards mean socials more often as a result of tension they're currently facing. Luckily, they'll still be able to work on their dynamic to fix things when the time comes. Would you describe the dynamic between Celeste and Carlos as being strained? Oh, very much so. Oh, very much so. Oh, very much so. He is pissed. He is gobsmacked. She rejects his marriage proposal and she just goes and kisses another man in front of him. I can't. He's so pissed off. Yeah, you like that, Carlos? Yeah, you like that, Carlos? <laughs> He's turned his back like a child. <laughs> the amount of drama you can make with this pack is insane. This is hilarious. He is so upset. Oh, she's dip kissing him and everything. That's right. That's right. Oh, he's smitten. She's got him wrapped. Look at him. He's so upset. I'm feeling very unsatisfied in our relationship. If you are mean to me while I feel this way, our romantic relationship will suffer. Good. Let it suffer. Let it suffer and let you suffer, babe. You put her through enough already. She's embarrassed, caught with another from cheating. Girl, there's no need to be embarrassed, okay? He's 10 times hotter, 10 times nicer. Let's really show him. Let's, let's really show him how little he means to you yes girl they're gonna go woohoo in a blanket oh oh yeah I'll watch her walk away that's what you get for treating her like garbage girl what is that outfit i did not give you that outfit get on that blanket girl this is actually so romantic under the trees and near these pink flowers and everything yeah girl yeah girl i'm so proud of her i'm so happy for her oh man they tearing that up <gasps> oh <laughs> Romantic satisfaction ends. <laughs> oh, they're done. They're done for. Yeah, you watch that. You watch that. He's so upset like a little puppy. Now Jeffrey's calling her. Are you up for grabbing tea or coffee? Maybe even a pastry. I can meet you in an hour. No, they tore it up. They tore it up. Oh, he's going to go cry. Not him crying in someone else's bed. <laughs> I love this pack. I'm I'm done. <laughs> I love this pack. <laughs> this is giving Sims 2 drama. I love it. I literally am in love with this pack already. And now we have three done. We've done Manuel, we've done Aziz, and we've done Carlos. And we've also broken Carlos's heart and probably ruined his trust forever. Now it's just Yoltik. And Yoltik has been extremely stubborn and I genuinely can't figure out why that is. So Yoltik is our last last one that we need to do and what i want to do for yoltik in particular if we're able to get to that point is i want to take him back to her place i want to try out the vibrating bed and i want to try out the costumes but it's going to take a lot more work to get yoltik it's very clear so i'm thinking that she goes with yoltik just the two of them out to maybe like the lounge or the club just be really friendly with each other and then try to flirt because i literally don't know what else is causing this man to not flirt back with her like have you seen her she's ethereal okay we're here with yoltik he is in a bad mood 
mood yet again. And we're at this park lot that I put down. This is from the gallery. I did add the blankets to it. I added this to one of the empty lots and I just figure, yeah, we just chill with him here for a bit, get to know him, talk with him because apparently, you know, he's too good for us. So let's see what's up because he's my last conquest. Jeffrey is calling again. I'm in town for a while and I was wondering if I could stay at your place for a few, no, go away get lost please so yeah the plan is to just try to get friendly with him as high as we possibly can to see if we can flirt with him afterwards and it would be successful because i don't know what's taking so long with this man so i'm just gonna do a bunch of different friendly interactions ask about hobbies and skills let's flatter him let's butter him up a bit let's I swear to God, Jeffrey, leave me alone. See, look at that happy couple over there cuddling. That could be us, Yoltik. Okay, their friendship bar has gone up a bit, but I still want it to go up a bit more. God, I've never put in so much effort for a man to get some woohoo. Not once. I feel ashamed. I feel embarrassed. All this for a man? For an EA man? Who are y'all? Did we say you could sit here? They're gonna literally cuddle right in front of her when she's trying to get with this man. That is diabolical. Oh, 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 oh. Celeste has learned more about Yoltik and is now unattracted to him. <gasps> No, what happened? He's romantically reserved. That's why he hasn't been flirting back with her. He's romantically reserved. Oh no, and she doesn't like that. She's unattracted to him, no way. Can they even get together then? If she considers him unattractive? Oh my God, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well that means just like being romantically reserved. He just needs to bond with the person more or the sim more. Like they're almost close to being good friends. So I figure like maybe after a few more interactions, she might be able to do it. They just became good friends. Let's see if we can flirt with him now. <gasps> yes, he's accepting it finally. Oh my God, okay, this is good. This is good, this is good. We're so close, we're so close. It's working, it's excited ask a risque question oh i'm so happy this is finally working i was so frustrated <gasps> they have a romance bar finally 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 oh he's smitten oh there we go he was just a little bit shy he's actually so adorable <laughs> my girl really did it okay she hasn't done it yet we haven't succeeded yet but we're almost there we are almost there we're going back to her place that's what we're doing baby we're not here to watch tv we're here to do a lot more than that honey oh this is going so well this is going so much better than i could have imagined oh that's so cute <laughs> oh these sims have a better romantic life than i do what the oh this is my lie on lap mod i did not tell them to do that but kind of cute i can't he's my favorite for sure okay so what about the costumes okay she's gonna go put on her peach costume oh oh my god okay and now i'm gonna call him to wear a costume okay he's coming <laughs> he's gonna pick a costume i wonder what he's gonna pick This EA man is told to wear a costume and he picks Princess Leia out of all things. Okay, for sure. <laughs> I'm not gonna make fun of him. He's romantically reserved. He has become comfortable enough with Celeste to do this. So you know what? Good for him. I, I support. Oh, they're wearing magic. <laughs> Oh, that's so adorable. They have to kiss. That's right. Because we didn't do that with Carlos before and they couldn't woohoo. Go ahead, kiss. Oh, you'll tick you come so far. <laughs> oh, yes. Break it down, girl. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the vibration on and finally have them woohoo. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, my goodness. She did it. Oh, my goodness. She did it. <laughs> Oh my God. And just like that, our challenge is complete. Celeste has officially woohooed with every single male Sim Townie in Ciudad and Namorada. Look at them. They're so cute. She did it, y'all. She did it. Celeste Singh has officially woohooed with every single male townie in Ciudad and Namorada. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it just as much as I enjoyed making it. I had a really great time exploring this pack and doing this chaotic romantic stuff with you guys. I really did enjoy it. I'm really looking forward to having this pack in my game and exploring it even more and hopefully making another video about it in the near future. And thank you again to the EA Creator Network for sponsoring this video and giving me early access to this pack. 
Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know if you'll be buying the pack and what you look forward to the most with this pack. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.